Today we are going to be learning how to add components to our models in Sage Modeler, as well as how to add relationships between those components, and how to save your model. To add a pre-populated icon, simply click and drag the icon you want to use into the space below. Remembering to name it. To create a relationship between components, select the arrow tool above the right side of the icon that you'd like the relationship to be coming from. Drag the arrow to the icon you're creating a relationship with. To define the relationship, double click on the arrow leading to the icon. An increase in the hyena population causes the gazelle population to decrease. To further define the relationship, you can select Settings on the right side of the screen and under the Relationships tab, select Expanded Set of Relationships. By double clicking the line again, we can now see a new tab has appeared. Here we are able to further define the relationship. Here we are showing that an increase in grass causes the gazelle population to also increase. To add a new icon that's not in the pre-populated list, Head to the left side of the screen and select New Image. Once you've found an image that you like, select it and select Add Image. We can now use this icon in our model. Like the hyena, cheetah also hunt gazelle. An increase in the cheetah population causes the gazelle population to decrease. Your teacher will give you directions on where they want you to save your model. It is also a good idea to save your model in a separate document as well. To do this, select the menu button at the top left of the screen. Then select Share, and then Get Link to Shared View. Then select Enable Sharing. Once your link has been generated, select Copy. In this example, we'll be pasting the link to the model in a Google Doc. 